I've already built the frame. It's just a one inch square tubing. It's about 25, 26 by 30. Uh, now all I got to do is figure out about where I want to punch a hole in the, these pads. Where I place them is going to be a compromise between keeping this lip underneath the frame as far as possible and having enough clearance for the nut to go on. So it looks like I'll get them as close to the edge as I think I can and still have room for the weld and tighten the nut. I center punched it where I'm going to need to drill it and welded it. Weld it on this corner because I'm going to have to grind that off for weld clearance anyway. And this corner because I'll probably radius it. So I'll just set that in there like that. Get rid of all the trash on the magnet. I've got a magnet that'll do a way better job. A lot longer and flatter. A lot stronger too. kind of jumped over making these two cross braces um, that's just a matter of matching the bolt pattern on the stand that I already have and I've already tacked them in place I've tested it checked it holes are right so I'm going to finish welding it So I'm putting mesh on the bottom of it so I can lay weight on it if I need to or I can use it for storage. But I cut it so it'll go halfway out on the bottom of this edge. Got it butted against here right now. What I'm going to do is I'm going to have to trim it around the tabs that I made to mount the wheels on and then it'll slide underneath halfway out. It'll lay on top of these two cross stringers. Should stay where I need it to stay. Please, honey, I've been in a battle, but you really didn't hurt me with it. Hey, what are you doing with that microwave? 
Well, I've got the tubing bender on wheels now. Now I'm going to assemble the uh, Swag Off-Road Hydraulic Kit. Comes with everything you need to do it. Uh, I bought the unwelded version. I have to do a few welds on it. Comes with all the bushing spacers. A knob for the jack. Bought the air over hydraulic from Harbor Freight. Already put the attach arms on it. Still got to tighten the bolts. Nothing to do now but weld it together, install it, and see how well it bends tubing.